Welcome to Real Estate Investment Management Brokers Development LLC, changing out a shower head. If you want to change out your shower head, the first thing you need to do is get the tools. This is an adjustable wrench. This is a plumber's wrench. And this is Teflon tape. Okay. First thing you want to do is examine your pipe. If you look right here, there's a bolt that the adjustable wrench can hold on to. Here is just a pipe shaft that the plumber's wrench can hold on to. Now, you take your adjustable wrench on the bottom where there's a bolt and you fit it in accordingly and you're about to go lefty-loosey on this. But before you do, there might be too much pressure here and you can't turn it to the left without exerting a lot of pressure on the pipe and you might be worried about breaking it. So, you introduce your plumber's wrench here and you put it on the top. This plumber's wrench, when you open it correctly, will grab on the shaft of the pipe and allow you to have counter pressure and leverage to the opposite way you're screwing the shower head bolt off. So, I'm putting pressure on the plumber's wrench on the top on the shaft of the pipe, and on the bottom, the adjustable wrench is being uh, pressured and leveraged to the left, lefty-loosey. Now, after you get it going, you can remove the plumber's wrench. You don't need it anymore. And you lefty-loosey. And at some point, you can just turn this with your hand. And you take that off. Unscrew the shower head you don't want. Then, you introduce your plumber's tape. And when I heard plumber's tape, I thought it was sticky. But it's not sticky. It's just plumber's tape that will stop leaks from happening when it's wrapped around the thread of the pipes. So you wrap the plumber's tape around the thread of the pipe one or two times, maybe three at most, but you don't want too much plumber's tape or you won't be able to screw in your new shower head. Then you take your new shower head and you screw that on. You start with your hand Righty tighty lefty loosey. You move the threads in there. And then you reintroduce your adjustable wrench. So you can turn that properly. Now at some point it's going to get hard. And then you know to stop. You don't want to over tighten it. Then we turn on the shower to see if it works. Now we evaluate to see if there's a leak here at this joint. If there isn't, we were successful. We hope this helps you learn how to install a shower head in your apartment. Thank you.